a lot of women they don't come during sexual intercourse yes they don't come you know a man can come anytime like as far a man is having sex it's easy for them to come yeah it's easy for them to ejaculate but a lot of women don't come during sexual intercourse for me i believe that sex is meant to be enjoyed ought to be enjoyed by both the man and the woman not just the man enjoying the sex and also not just the woman enjoying the sex it should be happiness on both sides good evening everyone and welcome back to nurses lecture room youtube channel my name is messi mary popularly known as a nurse with the difference and i make learning easy and accessible for all my viewers today i'm going to be sharing with you all especially the women that don't come 10 reasons why a woman does not come 10 reasons why a woman will not come so if you are in this show you really want to know why a woman will not come this video is for you but before we go into the details into this class if you are new on our youtube channel please click on the subscribe button turn on the notification bell so you don't miss out for all my returning subscribers this is not Miss Mary saying thank you let's go there all right welcome back like i earlier said today i'm going to be sharing with you 10 reasons why a lady will not come yes so 10 reasons why a lady will not come so the first one i have to share with you is that they are busy worrying about their body yes most ladies are worrying about their body while a man is busy enjoying the whole sexual experience while a man is busy waiting for his ejaculation to take place most ladies are busy thinking about their body beauty they are busy thinking about the stretch mark in their back they are busy thinking about their, uh, their the fats in their tummy, their big tummy. They are busy thinking about the pimples in their face. They are busy thinking about the fact that they are not attractive. They are thinking about their body. So if you are a lady and you are like, oh, 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 you are thinking about your body during sexual intercourse, thinking about what the man feel about your body during sexual intercourse, with that mindset, you are not likely to come because you have a lot of things thinking rather than focusing on the sexual intercourse you are involved in then the second thing is you are busy thinking about the orgasm you are busy thinking about the orgasm You're like oh am i going to come will i come this and the, that orgasm keep coming through your mind you feel oh i've been having sexual intercourse yet i don't have orgasm with this particular sexual intercourse allow me to enjoy orgasm you are thinking oh why don't i get orgasm now so stop thinking about the orgasm itself and focus on the sex itself stop thinking about your body beauty stop thinking about the orgasm on its own and focus on the sexual intercourse that you are having with your partner at that particular moment then the third reasons why a lady will not come is because they are still learning how they are still learning how especially for men that got married to women that are virgins that don't have sexual experience these women are still learning how that is why they have not come that is why they are not coming during sexual intercourse so as a man you don't have to blame that particular moment that woman at that particular moment what you have to do is to encourage her teach her if you know better than her and find her g-spot find what makes her go with find what incites her both of you should learn each other to be able to enjoy this whole thing called sex. So if a lady is still learning how, the how about sex, she might not come during sexual intercourse. Then the fourth reason is that most women don't get enough clitoral stimulations. They don't get what enough clitoral stimulations. Most people feel that penetrative sex will make a woman come, will make her reach her orgasm. No, some women come when there is enough clitoral stimulation when they get in a lot of clitoral stimulations rather than penetrating sex so that is why it's advisable for men not to just go direct not to just penetrate easily but actually give their ladies some clitoral stimulations before the sexual intercourse proper so that is the what that is the fourth the fifth point is that some women are still recovering from trauma their first encounter with sexual intercourse but can be traumatizing and that has actually damaged their mindset damaged their mentality about sex so some also women have experienced abuse like sexual abuse and they have this post-traumatic stress disorder that the sound of sex actually irritates them 
So trauma can actually affect a lady's mindset. And no matter what you do to her, she's not going to come during sexual intercourse. So if you are that particular lady and you're having post-traumatic stress disorder as a result of sexual abuse, it's advisable you see a sex therapist or a psychotherapy to therapist to help you out or to help you get out of that particular situation. That's the fifth point. Then the sixth point is you are worrying too much. Yes, as a lady, you have a lot to think about. You have your husband to think about. You have your kids to think about. You you have your work to think about. You have a lot of things going through your mind. So these things keep distorting your mind, keep distracting your attention. So you won't be able to focus on that sexual intercourse. That alone can make you not to come when the need be. So that is why it is advisable at least a woman should go on a vacation. That takes her attention from the children. That takes her attention from work. That takes her attention from everything around and makes her focus on the spouse proper. So as a woman, try as much as possible during sexual intercourse to forget about anything that is happening around you. Yes. I'm not saying you should neglect your kids. I'm not saying you should neglect the families. I'm just trying to tell you that when you want to have sex, know it is time for fun. Don't put any mindset in your mind. Don't have anything in your mind that should disturb you. Don't. Don't have anything in your mind that should disturb you. That can distort you and make you not to come. Then the sixth point I have to share is worrying about getting pregnant. Like a lot of women, they see after marriage, the next thing is to get pregnant, is to get a baby. So during sex, all their mind is, oh, this sex is going to lead to a baby. This sex is going to lead to a baby. They are not thinking about the fun involved in sexual intercourse, but they are thinking about the baby that is likely going to come, the pregnancy that is likely going to come from the sexual intercourse. So with that mindset, you are expecting a baby, you are expecting a baby, you are expecting a baby, you won't be able to enjoy the flow of sexual intercourse and that can affect your ability to come. And also those that don't want to get pregnant, they are like worried, oh, am I going to get pregnant? I don't want to get pregnant. Will this sexual intercourse finally result in pregnancy? So that thought actually disturbs the mind and that makes them not to come during sexual intercourse. So that is that. Then let's talk about the number eight point, pregnancy. Pregnancy, yes. Pregnancy has a role to play when it comes to sexual intercourse. Yes, it has a role to play. Some women, they normally come during sexual intercourse, but when they become pregnant, they no longer come during sexual intercourse because the hormones are playing with their body. The hormones are dancing. The hormones are saying another music during pregnancy. So most ladies during pregnancy, especially at the beginning, the first trimester, their sexual urge dies down and that can affect their coming during sexual intercourse then the number nine point i have to share it's female genital mutilation which we popularly known as female circumcision but ladies that have been circumcised because most circumcision some circumcision the clitoris is being removed and we all know that clitoral stimulation actually makes a lady come like yes it makes a lady come so when there is no clitoris to stimulate as a result of female genital mutilation that can affect a lady's sexual life and that will not make her to come during sexual intercourse so that is why i am saying no to female genital mutilation because i am of the opinion that both a lady and the man are expected to enjoy sex to the fullness and not just the man that is that is expected to enjoy sex then the last one is i have to share is hormonal changes which is number 10 hormonal changes as a result of childbirth, as a result of menopause, this can affect a lady's sexual intercourse. Especially ladies that do come on normal base, they come during sexual intercourse, they get to their orgasm during sexual intercourse. But as a result of hormonal changes that takes place as a result of childbirth and also menopause, that can affect their sexual life and their orgasm decreases and coming becomes difficult. So these are the 10 points I have to share with you, the reasons why ladies do not come during sexual 
intercourse. In summary, one thing I advise is that ladies should stop thinking and focus on the sex while having sex. Yes, forget about the body builds, forget about the orgasm itself, forget about anything, forget about the fridge, forget about the food, forget about the, uh, uh, the baby at that moment. <laughs> forget about everything, forget about this noise as that is entering this video now, forget about the noise and focus on the flow. Yes. If you as a lady must enjoy sex, you have to focus on the flow. When it comes like, oh, you have stretch mark, your stomach is very big, tell yourself, that's not important at the moment. This moment, I want to enjoy myself. Yeah. When it comes again, oh, your face has a lot of pimples, or it comes again, you are looking ugly. When that mindset comes to take charge over you, it is time for you to tell yourself, that does not matter. While I am here is not to think about my pimples. I'm here to enjoy the flow. Focus more on the sex, like the guys do. Focus on it more, and you see yourself getting to orgasm, getting more wet, getting getting the flow, and enjoying the whole sexual intercourse story. So this is my advice in general. So I hope this video help you understand the reasons why ladies don't come. Thank you very much for staying tuned. Thank you very much for watching this video, this educating video. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to subscribe and also don't forget to share with a friend if you got value. For all our returning subscribers, this is Nosmesi Mary saying thank you. Bye and see you in our next video.